Fashion and style are one of the key players in the media industry. Most times, if you want to get the job, you have to look the parts. The role of fashion definitely cannot be underplayed in the media industry. Style, like they say, is inborn. And these guys definitely have the style DNA. And they have managed to grow from regular faces to show-stopping personalities. Today, we do a roundup of some of the most stylish media personalities. These guys are constantly changing the fashion game one outfit at a time. These guys have made it a habit to slay effortlessly and ever so gracefully each and every time they step out both on and off the job. Don't go anywhere, as when we come back, we'll be rounding up the list of all your favourite media personalities. Hi guys, my name is Oluwato Siogunadigwe. My name is Laura, I'm a TV presenter. My name is Favor, I'm a fashion editor. My name is Arika Dimples, I'm a podcaster. My name is Toyi and I'm the public relations manager for Naira Box. Today on Spice Most, we're talking about most stylish media personality. Stay tuned. Tokyo Makiwa is one of the few media personalities who has been able to successfully conquer radio, TV and print media, and also fashion. Tokyo, who was a radio and TV on-air personality, also recently published her Unbecoming book, which sold out all over Nigeria and the world. Tokyo's style is so effortless and most young girls see her as gold when it comes to fashion and conquering the media industry. With over 1 million followers on Instagram, Tokyo has managed to slay her way to the top. Tokyo is a slayer. Tokyo knows how to dress. Tokyo understands her body and she dresses the parts. She understands the event and she gives you what you want. She's never understated and she kills it all the time. Every time she comes out, even if it's just on a normal day out, you know, to get her hair done or something, she always looks in point. Red carpet, she's amazing. Um, Instagram popping on the daily. Baby girl, you're lit. Allow me to use that word. You slay it all the time. Um, you are definitely someone to look out for with your style. Uh, now I can wear designer for Africa. And I think that aside being styled, she really knows how to put stuff together by herself. I rarely see styled by on her page, except she doesn't give credit. But I think that she's really good. Her style is amazing, like simple, yes, and it's very. She's always. She looks very comfortable in everything she wears. When you see an outfit that Tokyo wears, you actually want to go and cop that kind of outfit. You want to buy something that looks like that outfit. She's very good. She's very good with clothes in general. She sometimes gets a stylist to get her outfits, and sometimes she styles herself. And both ways, it just works really, really well. She's always looking good on the red carpet on her pictures on Instagram, like Tokyo, Tokyo, is, Tokyo is really good with clothes and yeah. I would say she is trendy. I don't think she has like a particular style, like, you know, when you see Tokyo and something, you know that, oh, this is such a Tokyo outfit. No, I don't think so. But I think that, you know, she has a good body. Clothes look great on her. Um, she's, you know, you want to sell your piece. You need to get Tokyo back in what to wear it and, um, yeah, so basically, I would say, you know, she, she's got. Noble Igwe is very famously known for his front door slay game. In fact, Noble Igwe and Toki Makinwa make the front door Instagram picture pose a trend. This unapologetically Igwe man has constantly found ways to infuse his culture with his style and it always works. Noble creates a niche for himself in fashion by always trying something new. He's very quick to pair the local Igbo cap with a suit, and it always works. Um, he gets it right every time he's on the carpet. Well, except that one time he wore those really short shorts. Like, you know, I feel like if you're gonna wear shorts, give yourself a little breathing space, unless they're denims. Now, denims, yeah, you can get away with it if it's a little hugging or anything, but I felt those shorts were too short, and I felt they were too hugging. But with everything else, his style, his Agbada, oh my God, you look so good in Agbada, but you're not Yoruba. I don't know how. And also, that your red door. Nobu knows, he doesn't just know fashion, Nobu knows fashion and has style. He balances both. And it's actually very good that you have men who take, who take their parents seriously. People might say, oh, men are not meant to do that, men are not meant to blah, 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 blah. 